What's happening, Media Maniacs? This is your boy, Media Fiend. I got something I want to talk to y'all about. So, your boy, your boy is on his way to physical therapy right now. And, uh, you know, because I messed myself up at work pretty bad. And um, I was doing my morning routine, which uh, some of that includes taking a few minutes, getting on the socials, seeing what's new, you know, any news, what people are doing with their lives is this early in the morning. Um, and you know, media news and stuff to see what, you, you know, what's out there. So as I was scrolling down, I saw something that caught my eye and I wanted to talk about it with y'all and let me know what y'all think. Um, I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts on it. Um, and yeah, I mean, check it out. Let's talk about this. So as you see right there, Hugh Jackman is on the set of Deadpool 3 as Wolverine and he is donning the yellow and black suit. Is this a real image? That's all I want to know. Is this real? Because guys, if this is real, then this is a game changer. All right. So let me give you a little backstory. I was born in the late 80s you know, towards the end of the 80s. So I didn't get to experience all that 80s goodness when it happened. I was more like a like a 90s baby because I remember most of my memories are from the 90s, okay? So I don't know how many of y'all are 90s babies like your boy, but there was this show called X-Men, the animated series. And if you know it, you know it. You can't forget it. It starts off with this huge intro. It's like the coolest intro theme song ever. And um, your boy was partial to Wolverine and Gambit himself, okay? But in that show, Wolverine always donned a yellow, blue, black kind of like suit, you know? And it was bad, you know? And yeah, he had a mask in the cartoon, and I can see if they don't use the mask here. But I'm not mad at this. I'm not mad at this one bit because, look, I always tell myself... Certain people were born to play the part. You know, you got Robert England as Freddy Krueger. Ain't nobody touching that again. You got Jensen Ackles as Dean Winchester. Nobody's going to be Dean Winchester ever again. You know, same with Jared Padalecki as Sam Winchester. Nobody's going to touch those. Ryan Reynolds as Deadpool. He, that dude was born to play Deadpool. And then you got Hugh Jackman as Wolverine. That man is right out the comics, bro. Hugh Jackman as Wolverine is fucking right out the comic books sorry about the sorry about the f word but um so seeing hugh jackman all jacked up for the wolverine role and donning the old school wolverine outfit is insane to me because it's like my childhood is coming back for a visit and it's it's amazing um i can't wait for Deadpool 3, you know, of course, Disney Marvel is taking this over, but they said it's going to be an R-rated Deadpool, which at this point, I just don't see Deadpool being anything other than R-rated. You know, I tried to watch that Deadpool Once Upon a Deadpool, where they toned all of it down, and yeah, it was still Deadpool 2, but it was like a PG-13 cut, and boy, that was, it was good because it was Deadpool, but it was rough to get through because they cut out all the cursing and all the hard stuff, and a watered down Deadpool, at least for your boy, doesn't work. So let me know in the comment section what you think. Whether is this exciting for you, like it is for me, seeing Wolverine don the yellow, like this is my childhood, guys. Like, and it's coming to life. And also, all the stuff that Deadpool three is supposedly doing, like bringing Ben Affleck in as Daredevil. I heard that. I heard um, Jennifer Gardner as Elektra. I mean, why? her i don't understand but they're bringing back halle berry is storm you know all these other x-men like is this is this going to be the beginning of like the deadpool era in the x-men that's what i'm wondering like does he finally join the x-men because you know colossus and the other two are trying to get him to join x-men so which timeline are they going to jump because you know how Deadpool always breaks that fourth wall. You know what I mean? He's always talking about um, he knows he's aware that he's in a comic. So it's going to be fun to see what they explore. And, you know, Disney Marvel is pretty good. I mean, yeah, it's had some flamers, flaming turds lately. But 
Um, they also had some really great ones too. So not a big fan of the new phase, um, but they've had some they've had some hitters. So, but yeah, guys, let me know in the comment section. Are you excited for the new Deadpool movie? Like your boy is. Um, are you excited to see Hugh Jackman play Wolverine one more time at least? You know because. Back in 2017 with Logan, I thought that was it. I thought we was done with Wolverine, you know? I thought he was dead and gone, you know? Spoiler alert if you haven't seen it. He dies at the end. Um, but, yeah, so, I don't know, guys. But, anyways, thank you guys for listening to this spiel. Um, your boy, like I said, he's on his way to physical therapy right now. I just had to take a minute to talk about this because uh, I'm super excited about the direction that this new Deadpool 3 is going. Um let me know in the comment section if you're just as excited um, and if you're going to go see it. If is it a day one for you or is it, you know, wait till it comes the video on demand. Let me know in the comment section. But all right, guys, I love you guys. Thank you, guys. And hmm, since it's Media Fiend, till we meet again, stay chill. All right, we out, guys. Later.